What is good? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to an insane replay that probably arguably one of my top replays that I've ever witnessed and commentated and personally have been inside the same match that this replay has been taken out of. My boy Yaha out of the straight clan. I am platooning with him. 7.4 thousand damage dealt in this game, man. And you guys will see how I got carried insane this game, but you know, hey, we gotta sacrifice the win rate, we gotta sacrifice the average damage though, we gotta sacrifice my dignity so we can get that top tier snexy content for you guys. <laughs> but if you guys did enjoy the video, make sure to drop subscribe down below. Uh, this is the reason why I dealt like 800 damage this game, man. I really thought everyone was middle. E100 beat me for 718 damage. I beat him back for 441. I thought the FB was gonna support me from behind. Uh, he's really camping right there. But boy, I was wrong, man. Boy, I was wrong. Type 71 decides to come push me. FB misses his shot, so there's really no reason for me. And then I'm gonna get beaten by this tank right here, man. <laughs> uh, like, I'm. I'm just dead, man. There's nothing I can do about it. I really am just dead. So, right off the bat, I die here. But you know what? Who cares about me, man? It's about my boy, Yaha, rocking the FV 2115 right here, man. He's getting some shots onto that E4, I believe, right? Is that the E4? But, uh, this little guy I see here, he gets a nice shot onto the E4, tracking him. I think it's still still, by the way. Another tank from our team is hitting him. But unfortunately, I can't really get a good angle here, man. I I don't know why I get that bad camera angle. But the E4 does die here. Now, it is a situation where they have eliminated two tanks. We have only eliminated one. But the I-7 decides to push for some reason. We are back with the beautiful angle here. Minus 413 damage onto the I-7. Can the Yag PZ E100... Get at least a shot onto the ISM before he dies. Because there's an E100, Type 71, and the FB that eliminated me last time. But no, he cannot get a shot onto the tank. But obviously, you got to finish off that I7 right here, man. I7 does deal damage to Yaha, but he does eliminate him. Type 71 does do damage as well. Kind of lucky, but he gets at least one shot off onto the Type 7, I believe, before he runs away retreats back into a better position here type 71 beams the e5 maybe not the e3 yeah is here to eliminate the type 71 now brought back to a 4v3 here e100 beams the wz i think that was a he shell by the looks of it only minus 200 damage yeah it does shoot the e100 and you'll see later on in this uh when he faces the e100 on a 1v1 situation that that dude's Turret is just like <laughs> look at this guy's turret, man. This is so so much bullet holes. If we could angle it and stay look at that. <laughs> I thought that was pretty funny, man. 4v3 situation here. You can also get a nice gold round onto the E100's turret. And, and yes, he does. Minus 356. He does limit the WZ though. It's a 3v3 situation here. Is this 3v3 situation winnable? You know what? Who knows? But he obviously has the higher DPM than the E100 now. It's just only a question if the E100 can take a shot onto Yaha before he dies. And he cannot, man. Yaha is on 1.8k HP. Then the FB is running away here to Yaha. Minus 347. He has two more shots, I believe, the FB. E5 has to get a shot. And yes, he does. But fortunate for Yaha, the FB... Is I don't know if you guys just saw that man. The E5 just bounced off the FB, but hey, that's perfect for Yaha if he does eliminate the FB, in which he will. That's four kills, and if he does kill this last tank that the E3 is fighting, which the, is the chieftain, Yaha can get five kills, which guarantees him a mastery. Even though this man has done 7.2k damage right now, 7.4k damage now, I say mastery in the game chat because. I cannot tell how much damage he has when I was playing this game, but oh my goodness. 
7.3, 7.4k damage, man. Beautiful stuff, man. He got the mastery. He got the ace tanker. He's got the Riley Walters medal. He's got the high caliber. He's got the top gun. And he's got the steel wall for some reason. Very questionable steel wall here, man. Let's look at how much damage has been bounced. Fortunately, I don't think I can tell how much damage has been bounced, but you know what? If you're getting a steel wall in that tank, that's kind of crazy, man. Unless no one knows how to shoot, which I highly doubt in this lobby. No one knows how to shoot, man. But obviously, if you want to get a 7.4k damn, you obviously have to rely on teammates that do it. Zero to none damage, kind of like me here, me and these three other, two other people here, man. But you know what? That was a crazy game, man. If you guys did enjoy the video, make sure to drop a subscribe down below. Join the Discord, man. We're trying to grow a community there. We're trying to play all the games that I do play, stream on, live on Twitch, mostly every day. But I'll see you when I see you in my next video. Peace out.